All right, to some other big news today. He may be out of office, but officials say this ordeal is far from over. This afternoon, WYMT was the first to know Knox County School Board Chairman Dexter Smith resigned his position. The resignation comes after Kentucky State Police say someone or Smith had someone take the GED for him. As WYMT's Haley Minogue reports, this afternoon's events are something you have to see to believe. Earlier this afternoon, I watched from this building right across the street as Dexter Smith and an official from the Kentucky Department of Education exchanged words right in this parking lot. Smith was scheduled to meet with the official at 10 a.m. I watched as he arrived, spoke to lawyers, but stayed in the parking lot. The investigator seems to get tired of waiting and asked him one final time to go inside. When he shakes his head no, we went to question him ourselves. In an effort to get away, he almost hits this pickup truck, which belongs to the fire department. Just over an hour later, the Kentucky Department of Education confirms that Commissioner Pruitt received and accepted a resignation letter from Board Chairman Dexter Smith on Friday morning. While the resignation ends Smith's time on the school board, several agencies say their investigations are still ongoing. We have received information that uh, Mr. Smith did resign today as a Knox County School Board member. However, Kentucky State Police does have an open investigation on Mr. Smith, and we will continue that investigation. And we're just waiting at this time for the Commonwealth Attorney to allow us to present this case to a Knox King Grand Jury. Now the process of replacing Smith begins. So you might be wondering how voting is going to go now with the school board since they're down a member. If it happens to be 2-2, there's no swing vote. It just stays as a tie. Reporting in Knox County, I'm Haley Minogue, WYMT Mountain News. We reached out to the Commonwealth's attorney for Knox County, Jackie Steele, and Jackie said, quote, the quickest way to resolve the issue of the Board of Education and no superintendent at this time would be to get Smith's resignation. Steele and Smith reached an agreement. Smith's resignation would lead to no prosecution in relation to Smith's oath of office in 2012 and also in relation to the incident in Jackson County involving the GED this past March. Smith declined to comment on the issue, and his attorney also left before we could request a comment. We'll have much more on this story coming up tonight on Mountain News at 6.